Thank you for joining us today on Ola America TV. I am Alejandra Campos, and in today's cooking segment, we will be making some mini corn dog muffins. The ingredients we will be using are melted butter, two eggs, salt, buttermilk, sugar, cornmeal, hot dogs, flour, and some baking soda. The first step is to mix the melted butter with a cup of sugar. Once that is whisked together, we will add two eggs. We want to make sure this is completely whisked together. We will now set that aside. We will now mix together all of our dry ingredients. Once our dry ingredients are mixed together, we will add the buttermilk. Once that is that well, well mixed together, we will add it to the first mixture we made. We need this to be completely combi combined and mixed together because this will be the batter for our muffins. Once our batter is ready, we will pour one tablespoon of batter onto each mini muffin. The pan that I am using is non-stick, but if you would like to be safe, you can always add some non-stick spray just to prevent anything from sticking. While you are filling up the muffin tin, it might be a good idea to start preheating your oven. It should be set to 375 degrees. We have pre-cut our hot dogs into about a one inch size. So we put one piece of hot dog in each little circle. This is a recipe that's great for kids and they might even be able to help you in the kitchen. We will now stick this in the oven for about eight to 12 minutes or until our muffins are golden brown. Our mini muffins are now nice and golden so they're ready to be taken out of the oven. When we take the mini muffins out of the oven, it's important that we let them cool for about two or three minutes so that they don't break on us while taking them out. And as you can see, we now have these ready to eat. You can eat them plain or you can eat them with a little bit of ketchup. It's your choice. They're great either way. I hope you enjoyed today's recipe. For this and other recipes, make sure to check out our Facebook or YouTube page. I'm Alejandra Campos, and I hope to see you here next week with some more recipes.